Invertebrates make up a significant proportion of animal life on our planet, and their mating behaviors are incredibly diverse and fascinating. From the organized and complex communication of ants to the brutal and deadly sexual cannibalism of praying mantises, the behaviors exhibited by these species are both unique and critical to their survival. Other invertebrates, such as the redback spider and the honeybee, have evolved intricate courtship rituals to ensure successful mating. The vibrant and colorful peacock spider performs elaborate dances to attract a mate, while fireflies use flashing lights to communicate with potential partners. Despite their small size, the diverse mating behaviors of invertebrates play a crucial role in maintaining the balance of ecosystems and ensuring the continuation of their respective species. In this video, we will look into their mating behaviors. Without further ado, let's get started. Fireflies mating. Fireflies have a complex mating ritual that begins with the emergence of female fireflies in their adult form. These females only have a few weeks to live and their main goal is to find a suitable mate. As the sun sets, thousands of male fireflies light up the dusk, hoping to impress the female audience with their flashing lights. However, females are not easily impressed and are looking for something special. They prefer males that can sustain a long flash, as this indicates they have a larger nuptial gift, which is food for their developing eggs. When a female spots a male with potential, she opens the conversation by emitting a flash of her own. The male will only approach if the female responds with a specific light pattern, and if she does, they will mate. After mating and laying their eggs, all the adults die, so this spectacular light show only lasts for a few short weeks each summer. Praying Mantis Mating The praying mantis is known for its unique and somewhat gruesome mating behavior. While the male praying mantis may have a brief moment of pleasure, it often results in his demise at the hands, or rather mandibles, of the female. After a courtship dance and seduction by pheromones, the female praying mantis invites the male to mate. However, the act of mating often results in the male being decapitated by the female. Female praying mantises don't always kill their mates after mating. While some species do exhibit this behavior, others don't and in some cases, the male can even continue to mate with the female for some time after his head is removed. One theory is that it's a form of sexual cannibalism that ensures the survival of the female's offspring. By consuming the male, the female gains vital nutrients that she can use to support the growth of her eggs. If Redback Spider Mating Male Australian redback spiders essentially sacrifice themselves after mating with a female. During copulation, males purposely position their abdomens near the female's mouth, even though they are aware that she will most likely consume them. Only around 30% of male redback spiders survive their first mating. Most males do not survive their first time mating, as they have a short lifespan and are likely to die or get eaten by a predator before making it to another female's web. The female is often more than 100 times bigger than the male. Despite this vast size difference between males and females, the mating process is still successful. During copulation, the male redback spider will climb onto the female's web and use his pedipalps to transfer sperm to her reproductive organs. Despite the risks involved, male redback spiders continue to mate with their much larger counterparts, ensuring the survival of their species. Honeybee mating. Mating in the animal kingdom can often be a life or death affair. Honeybee males get to mate with the queen only once before they die. When the queen bee emerges from her hive in search of mating partners, drones will swarm around her hoping for a chance to mate. The fastest and bravest drones will be the ones to mount the queen mid-air and mate with her. However, the cost of this act is steep. Once a drone ejaculates, his testicles will explode and his endophallus will be left behind inside the queen. The drone then falls to the ground and dies. One would think that the other drones would learn from their brother's fates, but the competition is fierce and the next drone will take out the endophallus left by the previous drone and attempt to mate with the queen himself. This cycle continues until the queen has mated with as many drones as possible. Peacock Spider Mating 
The male peacock spider's courtship dance is a matter of life and death. If the female spider dislikes the male, she may quickly shake her abdomen or attack and eat him up, making courtship a dangerous affair for the suitor. However, in order to mate successfully, the male must perform an intricate dance using a brilliantly colored fan attached to his abdomen. Male jumping spiders are not very selective and will attempt to court any female they come across, even if she's a different species. The female signals her approval or disapproval by turning towards or away from the male. If the female approves of the male's dance, he may be allowed to mate, but if she isn't impressed, the male will become her next meal. This high-stakes courtship ritual is a fascinating example of the lengths that animals will go to in order to reproduce and pass on their genes. Ant mating. The queen ant produces a special scent. This scent is a powerful attractant for winged male ants from other nests who are drawn to the queen. The male ants that are attracted to the queen are enormous, similar in size to the queen herself. However, the journey to becoming a consort of the queen is not an easy one. The male must prove his fitness to the colony. The other ants, initially viewing the male as prey, must be convinced that he is a suitable consort for the queen. If the male is accepted, he will mate with the queen in the royal chamber. However, his time as a consort is short-lived. When his job is done, he retires from the royal chamber and dies. With this sacrifice, he will father several million offspring ensuring the continued success of the colony. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing content. Let us know in the comments what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.